Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Dawn Tries It. This is, yeah, this is gonna be something, this one. I'm a little nervous about this. Excuse my outfit, as always, um, I have on a mixture of summer and winter clothes. I need, if anybody out there, I need a um, menopause stylist. I need somebody to help me dress through menopause. So, but today I actually did need to have things exposed, skin exposed, because today, tribe, I am trying cupping. It's probably backwards. It's probably, yeah, okay. I'm trying cupping, guys. I know, I know. This is probably should come with a warning. Don't try this at home. Um, yeah, but you sent it in. Y'all don't care if I pass out. You just wanna see me do stuff. <laughs> Which is fine, because I actually have always wanted to try cupping, but I usually would, you know, would think I would try it with a licensed um, cupping therapist. But good old Amazon, $39.99. I found a little cupping kit on here, and I am going to do some self-cupping today. Now, in case you don't know what cupping is, it's, a, it's Ayurvedic. Um, it's an alternative healing uh, method. You put it on different parts of your body, um, it's great for to um, get rid of toxins. It's really great for pain, for muscles, um, you know, sore muscles, things like that. But there are a lot of other benefits to cupping, and we'll talk about that a little more. But let me show you what this looks like. It actually is a pretty little kid, right? Can you see that? I was a little impressed that it has all the little cupping things. Like ding, ding, ding. They're, they're made of plastic. Ding, ding, ding. They have the little things on it. It also comes with, um, what in the? I don't even know what to say about that. I set up a nice little area that I could do some cupping at. I wanted to have my green girls by me. My little faux little rug here so that I'm comfortable when I attach these things to my skin. Um, and plus, if the paramedics come, I want them to find me like in a nice area because they might be cute. Never know. Okay. Right. AccuZone Premium Cupping Set. How to use. Place a cup on the skin where massaging is needed. So I, you know, I'm always complaining about my shoulders. I think I'm going to do my shoulders and like my arm. So this way I can, I got props. I can hold it right up here and we can watch the cupping together. Um, now, when you do the cupping, when you put the cup on, it's supposed to bulge the skin up. So I'm a little scared. If my skin starts bulging up, I'm taking this damn cup off. Um, yeah. Place the cup on the skin when massaging is needed. Engage the pump on the cup and draw the trigger two to three times to pump out the air. Leave the cup on for about five to ten minutes. Damn. All right. So I'm going to start with... So you find one that's the appropriate size. Let me put the pump together first. So, you put the pump on here, and it said two, to, and then you put this on the cup. So you find a cup that's appropriate. So I'm gonna use this medium one, and I'm gonna put it right here. I'm only gonna do one, no, I'll do two, I'll do two. I'll do, it's like, it's more of an effect if I do two. I'll do two. So I'm gonna put one here and one there. So, you put the cup on there. I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh, okay, wait. Oh, all right, so look. You put the pump, the cup on there first. I don't know if you have to press it down. This is like, cupping by yourself is hard. Okay, wait. All right. She said two pumps. Or three. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Can you see? Guys, look at the bubble in my oh, oh my god. I don't think I'm gonna make it that alright. I'm gonna put the second one on. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want my arm to stay like this. And it hurts a little. It's really tight. Okay. Oh my goodness, stop it, Cuppy! All right. I'm getting weak, I'm getting weak. Ow. 
that actually does hurt. I can't even get the second one on. No, I'm gonna get it on, guys. I'm gonna do it for you. I do wanna see if this is really, oh, okay. I wanna see, all right, so I'm gonna do two. I can't even look at this. Is it three minutes yet? Okay. I think that's just about enough of it. All right, guys, so in order to release them, you just pull the, the oh, look at that, oh, pull these up, and it lets the air out. Oh, oh my gosh, that was a little scary. And I have marks now, I look like an alien. <laughs> Come on guys, when the next dawn tries it, ask me to go to the spa or to the beach or something like that. All right, let me sit though and actually see how I really feel because I want you to get something out of this. All right. I look like I was in a fight with a little small person that kept punching me in the arm. I'm gonna grab some dinner and then I'll come back and let you guys know if I feel something. Mama! Hey guys, I'm back. <laughs> it has been mm, three hours, maybe four hours. <sighs> what is that? What is that? It is a total bruise. And you know, they said it could happen. The one down here, I put two. That one's a little lighter, but look at that. Now, it doesn't hurt. But I guess I pulled all the blood to the top. I read up on it and it's normal. They said you can have like bruising. I have a polka dot arm now. Okay, so let me, get, <laughs> let me give you my little review of this. One, as crazy as this looks, I think I would do this again. And I'm gonna tell you why. I like all the benefits of cupping. Um, it actually is good for also for cellulite besides, you know, toxicity for muscles, for pain relief. There's a lot, I've been reading up more while my little bruise has been trying to heal and there's a lot of great benefits to it. The next time I try it, I would probably go to, to a professional and let them, let them do it. Um, I don't feel any pain. I don't know if I feel any difference, but, um, I didn't leave it on long enough. I think it was like five minutes I was supposed to leave it on. I think I got all scared. <laughs> I took it off fast. Um, so I don't know. I think it would have been better if I had somebody else do it and I was relaxed and maybe it was on my back or something different. But I can say I recommend the kit. I really like the kit. I think the kit was really nice. It was clean. Um, it actually worked the way it said it was supposed to work. It was a really nice kit. So what my plan is to go back and get it done professionally, see how they do it, see what happens, see the results, and then come back and do it on my own. But for now, um, I'm probably just, I don't know. I mean, I'll just get, maybe I'll just put a couple more around it and make it like a design or something. Be like, ooh, sort of like a little tattoo. This better be gone tomorrow. So I, um, I suggest if you do cupping, you, you don't do it during the summer when you're exposed like this. So yeah, but I'm gonna give cupping two thumbs up with a caveat. Find somebody else to teach you how to do it first and then do it again on your own. The kit gets two thumbs up and cupping gets two thumbs up, thumbs up. Dawn doing cupping, no. I don't think so. Oh, but I do have an idea. Wait a minute, let's see. Mm. You'll know I'm a little artist. Oh, look. Oh. Bye, guys. <laughs>